This video is about the trumpet lily, the oriental trumpet lily. It is the tallest of the lily varieties that we have at Harvesting History. It's a statuesque plant in the garden and will keep you entertained from the time it noses its way out of the soil until it thoroughly is destroyed by a frost in the fall. Some have fragrance, some do not have fragrance, but I can assure you each and every one is an outstanding presence in your garden. The oriental trumpets are the tallest of the lily varieties. Some can reach as much as six, once in a rare while, eight feet tall. So think tall, think statuesque, think oriental trumpet lily. This is truly a prince of an oriental lily. This is known as Purple Prince and it is in fact an oriental trumpet lily. But it's a character in the garden. It will keep you entertained for at least a month to six weeks. It starts out early, early in the summer when these stems begin to surface. When they begin to surface, they are deep burgundy. And in themselves, they're beautiful, just as the stem. But then, over time, the stems grow and grow and grow, and you <laughs> are treated to these incredible blossoms. First, you're treated to these incredibly colored buds. Again, they're as pretty almost as the blossom itself. And then finally, when you think you just can't take any more from this plant, it's just so beautiful, then it blooms. Those buds pop and they are so incredibly gorgeous. A true and deep reddish purple The plants themselves, over years, will get to be a good four to six feet tall, maybe even taller. <laughs> but in the first couple of years, you can count on them being about three to four feet. Again, take one more look as we step back. Look at this beautiful lily. Purple Prince and Oriental Trumpet Lily. This is Robert Swanson. Robert is an Oriental Trumpet Lily and the Oriental Trumpet Lilies are usually the tallest lilies in your garden. In addition to being the tallest or nearly the tallest, meaning Robert grows anywhere from about 40 inches to 44 inches, and in my garden often gets taller than that. But in addition to being so tall, Robert probably has the most distinctive coloring of any lily blossom currently available. As you can see, when we zoom in on this blossom, the outer petals, which curve back, which means they reflex, the outer petals are tipped with yellow and then have a gorgeous, deep burnt orange or rust color that then melts into that magnificent throat. I have never seen coloring on another lily like this. And maybe it's best that this lily was called Robert Swanson. For those of you who don't know who he was, he was a venture capitalist and a very successful one who decided to leave venture capital and to lead a company called Genentech. Genentech is the company that diagrammed the human genome, that described all of the parts of the human genome. So the fact that this very unusual 
genetically magnificent lily is named after someone like Robert Swanson is a good thing. Again, this is the oriental trumpet lily, Robert Swanson. I hope you've enjoyed this short video on the beautiful, elegant, statuesque oriental trumpet lilies. They are definitely a presence for any garden. And uh, if you have the space for them, I thoroughly encourage you, please put some of these lilies in your garden. Please come to our website. We have a great collection available for sale not just the two in this video. And our website is www.harvesting-history.com.